What's up, everybody? It's Neil with Nexus 7 Soft Modder, and today I'm gonna show you how you can um, easily back up your phone and application info with um, without a uh, custom recovery or needing to root your device. Um, so uh, let's get started. First of all, the first thing you should look into is just backing it up using the Google servers, which if you go under settings and go down to backup and reset, you can just check what you'd like. You can do a backup of my uh, data, uh, choose your backup account, automatic restore once you uh, restart your phone, and then you can uh, factory reset from here. But that should be your first line of defense, I guess, or um, your first backup plan. If you're still a little cautious and paranoid, then I would suggest downloading Helium from the uh, Google Play Store. <clears throat> a link is provided in the article on Nexus 7 Soft Modder. Uh, so you're going to download Helium, and you're also going to download the application to your your laptop because you'll you'll see right now why I need both. All right, so open Helium. All right, so I need to make a USB connection with my device and open the desktop application to enable this. All right, so I'm going to plug it in. And then, let's see, you can see my screen as well. And the laptop. And my device. All right, so let's open Helium. All right, so it's connecting. Hit OK. All right, so you see that big check mark, and you see that I've enabled the application. So let's just focus back on this bad boy. All right, so I mean, it's pretty, it's really straightforward actually. Um, you can see uh, the list of everything I got here. I could back up some launchers, a uh, user dictionary, and then a bunch of programs. And you just check what you want. You could select all. And then let's just run through this real quick. Hit select all, and you hit backup. Hit the cloud option. You'll see there's more options. You can use the Google Drive to back it up. There's Dropbox, and then there's a box. Um, the schedule backup is only uh, offered on the paid version, which isn't that much. But I mean, if you can remember to back up your stuff, then it's all right. You can do. You can back it up to your SD card and internal storage. Um, so after you select that, it'll just back it up, and it'll take like a second. It'll tell you uh, it's all backed up. All right, but if you're still a little um, weary or paranoid, hit this option up here and do PC download. All right, you see, I got a URL. And I'm going to type that in to my internet browser, and you'll see what comes up real quick. So it's... So I type that in, it's going <clears> to <throat> direct me to the Helium backup um, site, which is uh, specifically tailored to me because it gave me that URL. So from here, I can do the same thing, choose all my apps and stuff that I want, and then I just select backup, and this will create a uh, zip file that you can save and stash in your computer. And then if you want to restore stuff, it's as easy as just making the connection again and hitting uh, hitting PC download and it'll give you another URL and you connect your device and you just hit browse and you'll find your zip file and then you'll start backing it up if you want to back it up using your application just hit the tab saying restore and sync and you select where you um, where you stashed it and it'll easily back up your stuff sorry it'll easily restore your stuff it's pretty straightforward if you're not into rooting and you want to you want something that's going to work for you and back up your app app, app uh, application information then I would suggest doing that. Um hopefully you guys find this useful. If not, please don't leave me a distasteful comment. Like it, love it, hate it, subscribe and check out the full article on Nexus 7 Soft Modder. Thanks guys.